Hi guys, John McTaggart here. Today uh, we're going to talk about photography books and mainly two in particular and I think these are probably the only two books that you really are ever going to need to, uh, to to either start your business professionally or even do it amateur, as an amateur. Um, but the first one is probably one that most of you have heard of if you're a photography uh, aficionado at all. Uh, that's Understanding Exposure. It's by Brian Peterson. Uh, it's a uh, it's sort of a classic, I guess, if there's a classic photography books. Uh, it's been around since I think 1990 was the first edition of this, and it is an excellent all-around photography book. Um, goes over the, the basics of the exposure triangle, uh, the relationship between shutter speeds and apertures and, and ISO settings and film speed. It's good for film shooters, digital shooters. It's really a book that every photographer should have. Um, I, I love it. I still refer to it every once in a while. It's a nice as it serves as a good refresher sometimes. Um, highly, highly, highly recommend it. You can get it on Amazon. Uh, you can probably find it at your library, actually. It's a, like I said, it's sort of a photography classic. Super highly recommended. Now, the second book that I think everybody should have uh, their hands on isn't exactly a photography book, but it's one that every photographer, especially those who want to be professionals, should read. Um, I just finished it myself, and it's by a photographer who probably most of you have heard of, David Dushman, and he's a, a kind of a travel adventure photographer, dynamite photographer, but I'm, this, to me, is his best work. This is my Kindle edition of it, and it's How to Feed a Starving Artist. It's a money book, believe it or not. Uh, it's a financial field guide for creatives, solopreneurs, and other anarchists. Is that's the exact subtitle. It's fantastic. Um, as a creative person, a lot of us really aren't that good at that side of running a photography business. We are we excel at the creative part. We do a dynamite job um, with all that kind of stuff. But when it comes to the money and actually running the business and making it profitable and earning a living, hopefully, potentially, for most of us. This book is dynamite. And what I love about it is he's been there. He was in ruins financially for a while, and he turned it all around. He learned a lot of things, and he kind of gives us all a head up, heads up in this book. I have a Kindle edition of it, um, but they do sell it. Um, you can get it at craftandvision.com. Uh, as an ebook, as a download, as an ebook, I highly recommend it. Like I said, I can't can't tell you enough how much I learned from this book. It's a quick, easy read, nothing too over technical. A lot of it's actually common sense stuff that you just don't think about. It just shows you a way to apply it to um, your your photography business. And let's face it, a lot of us get into this because we love it and we would love to do it for a living. So this book, How to Feed a Starving Artist, is super highly recommended. Um, if you read one photography book this year, let this be the one. Um, <laughs> the last thing you want to do is start your business in the hole and have that kind of stress on top of the stress that comes with trying to get clients, uh, trying to, to satisfy those clients, as well as improving your craft. So read this book. Um, highly, highly recommended. Understanding Exposure, Brian Peterson is another great place to start. So until next time, uh, thank you guys very much. If you like this video, please like it and please subscribe. Um, we have a couple of subscribers in the last week or so, which is really very cool. Um, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks. Bye.